Hello everyone out there, this is Latios Azure, welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Black 2. Here we are in Castilia City, where we left off last time. Now, our team is, well, going to be changing a little bit, because we're going to do something very special today. Now we still have that egg, hopefully it'll hatch today, but here we have some event Pokemon. And these are going to... Make things a little bit interesting. So. Here we have... So, here we actually have, for now, Meloetta, Victini, Keldeo, and Janicek is in the PC for right now, but I want that egg to hatch, so we'll get back to that. Alright, now I know we've already been here, but we're going to go back to Liberty Island, well, Liberty Garden. Because now we have Victini. So, let's see what happens. Bikini! Hey, you know the Pokedex, Bikini was assigned a special number. Zero. I've heard the special number was assigned you in the hope that Bikini's power to b b bring victory um, and be shared with the trainer who travels with the Pokedex. How do you relate to Pokemon? As you find your Pokedex, you'll find your own answer. That's what I'm hoping for. See you! I don't know why, like, when I'm walking here some reason this emulator, like, the ground turns into, like, water. Weird. So, here we go. Victini seems to want to get out of the Pokeball. Will you let it out? Oh, sure. Hey, yeah, Victini looks really happy here. Victini return with an air of satisfaction. Does it do it every time you ring? Yeah, it looks like it does, so. So it looks like Victini is happy to see where it used to live for like, how long was it, like 2,000 years? I'm like, I don't know. Well, if that's the case, let's get back to Castilia City. I think it's really cool how, like, in the in black and white, you can get Victini, you can catch Victini there. Then in black two and white two, when you bring Victini there, it um gets to go back and see where it used to live. It's kind of cool. So here we go into this. Cafe, bay, I believe. Cafe Sonata. The scent you brought me reminded me of a long-ago melody from the fringes of my sepia tone memories. It was the song my mother loved. It makes me feel so nostalgic. Would you like to hear that melody? Sure. Another one that popped out of the Pokeball. Now I had to remember the relic song and had forgotten. That's uh, that's kind of cool, really. All right, I'm gonna give up round since this appears to do more damage and it's a special normal move. So my mother once told me of a Pokemon that played a melody and danced so lightly that it filled people's hearts with joy. 
Then sorrow darkened the entire world and the Pokemon's melody was lost. At the same time, somewhere, some red shoes were lost. When you came through the door, I remember the melody. The Pokemon that had forgotten how to dance began to step lightly once more. You are the inspiration. You are a mysterious child. Thanks to you, Mel, a lot of memories of my birthplace. Memories of when I was little. Memories of singing together after we finished gathering berries. All these memories can flung back. Alright, we got a Fun Fest berry mission, it looks like. Oh, this did it sing the relic song. Pariah form will become pirouette form, and vice versa. That's 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 cool. So a lot of um a lot of really cool things happen here in Castilia City, it seems like. I'm actually going to take Regina out of the PC, so, uh... This way, we can actually fly, because we are going to Flo Sessy Town. Recall, last time we were here, we battled Alder, but um, and met Benga. This time, however, behind his house, there's actually this like a little forest, I guess, or something. It's like very little here, but there's this thing right here. Three sharp marks are deeply cut into the rock. Kelly seems to want to get out of the Pokeball. Will you let it out? Sure. So it looks like the determined um, determination carved into the rock by Cobalion, Verizion, and Terrakion reminded Keldeo of Secret Sword. But Keldeo can't learn more than four moves, so teach it Secret Sword, sure. Sure. I'll get rid of Leer since I would never use it anyway. Even though I'm really not gonna be using these Pokemon, but eh, it's okay. Keldeo remembered Secret Sword. What? Keldeo is like thinking of them. Okay, that is cool. Kelion resolve to bat um to battle and his change into a resolute form. So Keldeo is now in its resolute form. That is cool. So, that was, that was interesting. So, here we are in Camilla Town, because there is but one more Pokemon that we have an event to attend with. So, here we go. Of course. They don't use Rue of Hell, and we find a Watchog. Of course. Well, you know what? Could it possibly hurt to just go for a Relic Song here just to demonstrate what it does here? Meloetta transformed. Let's see if it can. So another relic song should pro does it change form again? Well, the watchdog fell asleep. 
Oh, I see. The, um, Relic Song makes it change forms no matter, regardless of what form it's in. So, is it going to change forms again, or? Yeah. So, Melo had change transformed. Wait a second. I guess we're battling, uh, this backpacker. Interesting. Backpacker Jill. So outside of battle, then, it just reverts back to its normal form, I suppose. This isn't going to do very much, because it's part rock. Okay, that is probably going to take down Alouetta. Oh, Alouetta survived. Interesting. Wow, the stab psychic still wasn't enough. Well, another psychic should take down the Ammonite. Oh, and just for, um, clarification, I usually don't use legendary Pokemon in LPs. I was just trying to test out what, um, the Relic Song does. So... I will probably be putting Meloetta back in the PC, actually. Wow, that did a lot of damage. Although Henry is at a high level, I didn't expect it to do that much on a level 50-something Archaeops. You level 57 in North, why don't you just evolve it? I mean, I understand I have Henry and I didn't evolve him, but, well, I guess that kind of is the counterexample. Okay, that shield on is sturdy. That's, that's, that's nice. Speaking of Pokemon evolving, or should I say not evolving? So that is how the Relic Song works. But as I had stated, there is one more event we have that we can do. Alright, so I will let David back into the team. So, for now, Neil and Belle are still on the PC. You know what, this time I'm going to actually use a repel because, well, I'm going to use a repel. Really? Another backpacker. I should have just cut through the grass. Whatever, at least we're gaining experience from this. Experience that we will need in the future, I'm pretty sure, anyway. Because I am almost done with getting through all ten tournaments with the world leaders. So next time we will be facing the World Cha well, the Champions Tournament at the Pokemon World Tournament. So this will, I mean the last two episodes, except in the previous episode, just been like kind of interesting stuff that I guess that I could have probably done before, well done a little earlier, but I didn't get. The previous episode of stuff I didn't get to, that I just blatantly missed. This is kind of event stuff. Because 
Event Pokemon are cool. So, for like the third or fourth time, we're going this way. <laughs> I feel like we've been here so many times that it's kind of sad. And the power's still out right there. So, I think I'll use the repel because why not? Turn around. Turn around, veteran. I don't remember if I battled you, but I don't feel like battling you now. I battled you. Okay. Last time we were here, I believe we went on the ship and we battled Chorus. This time, we're going to be going into this actual laboratory. Oh, it's just a kid. You. It couldn't be. The fact you were here means you came to learn about the secret of Genesect. We, Team Plasma, revived Genesect as a fo from a fossil. Then we enhanced the Pokémon with the power of science. It is the strongest Pokémon in history! But our Lord Adam was not interested in this Genesect that, we mo that we was modified by the power of science. Science not much is the natural beauty of Pokémon. They're perfect beings. That's what he said. So our research was halted, and this facility was closed. However, the Genesec research is all mine. So if you want to know the Genesec secret, you'll have to beat me in battle. Battle scientists? Okay, sure. Is he gonna be like really strong or something, or is he just too close? Level 29? <laughs> okay, this is just this is just, just sad. X special. He's gonna raise special attack. That's not gonna help him because he's never gonna get a chance to attack. I don't understand people use items like that. I'll never understand that. Okay, a clang. So creative. You have a cling, you have a clink, you have a clang, and then you have a clink clang. I've lost everything. I forgot my duty as a scientist to make the world happy. That's what a scientist does? Okay. So this must be what I would, um what I get for trying to make a Pokemon into a tool for fighting. I'm going to wash my hands of this Genesect matter. I don't need this anymore, I'll give it to you. We got the Shock Drive. And hopefully I'm like this to change his type of move called Technoblast, so it can always have an advantage. Oh, there's another one in my other pocket. We also got the Burn Drive. I've given you all the drives. Use them how you wish. I believe there's two more that you can only get in White 2. So Technoblast, the user fi fires a beam of light at the, its target, a type changes depending on the drive that the user is holding. Okay. This is egg anywhere near hatching. No, okay. Well... Perhaps it'll hatch next time. Who knows. Then Bell can rejoin the team. But we will be picking on the world leaders next time. So thank you for watching. As always, like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you then. Goodbye.